prosecuted to the fullest extent of the law. The stern warning from the governor tonight is forged vaccine cards are popping up here in Hawaii. Officials say there are tough consequences for these actions. Christy Tamashiro has the details in a story that's new at 9. Forging your vaccination status on your vaccine card could land you behind bars. It's something officials say they're seeing as travelers look to skirt the quarantine rules and costly tests. We do have a case where we had um, travelers um, forging vaccination records that we've filed charges against and certainly will um, prosecute to the fullest extent of the law. The Attorney General's office says screening vaccination documents is an ongoing effort. While there hasn't been a spike in these types of incidents, there are always a few people who will try to cheat the system. We have been uh, pretty aggressive in enforcing, prosecuting uh, those violators that we become aware of. If convicted, the penalty is a fine of up to $5,000 or one year in prison. According to Honolulu police, in some situations, it could be considered tampering with a government record. With COVID surging on the Big Island, Mayor Mitch Roth says there's no room for this kind of illegal activity. You know, we're starting to, to see the need for a little bit increased enforcement. So we're meeting with the uh, police as well as the prosecutor to make sure that we will be taking this a lot more seriously as we move forward, especially when we're in the situation that we're in right now. In April, the Attorney General also put out a warning about websites selling fake or blank vaccine cards. A reminder from officials, it's also illegal to buy or sell these cards. Mayor Blangiardi says it's time for people to keep each other's safety in mind. So it's more about behaviors than it is about our enforcement and having people come to the realization of what, they, what we owe to each other in the spirit of community help. Christy Tomashiro, KH2 News, working for Hawaii.